Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer software testing interview question 386. That is, HTTPS protocol runs on which port number? That is a question. Okay, let me answer. HTTPS protocol runs on which port number? It runs on 443 port number. In the previous session or in the previous video, I was explaining about HTTP protocol, not HTTPS. In this session, HTTPS. HTTP protocol was running on port 80, whereas HTTPS protocol runs on port 443, okay? So this is a basic question that you generally get in the interviews, guys. Suddenly the interviewer will ask you, what is the port number on which HTTPS protocol runs on? You have to simply answer by saying, it runs on the port number 443, okay? So if you want to know more about what is a port number, what is port means and all, I have uh, have explained that in the previous video, guys. You can go to the previous video where you can understand what exactly is port. But HTTPS protocol runs on the port number 443, where the communication between the client and server via this protocol happens over a secure layer. Okay, secure communication between client and server. Your certificate is installed and encryption or decryption, okay, will happen. What does it mean? Here, guys, earlier, it was HTTP protocol which was running on 80 port number. Whatever the data that I was sending from the client machine, that is my laptop, I was browsing the application in the browser and uh, this password, I, I was uh, actually entering the password. The data is sent as it is without encrypting. As it is, the uh, data is being transited okay, to the server over the internet via the HTTP, HTTP protocol, which is running on port number 80. Okay, in an insecure manner, here the hacker, okay, hacker can eavesdrop. Eavesdrop means they can, uh, hacker using some tools, right? They can find out like uh, what's the data that is traveling between this client and server machine. They can find out your password. Sensitive information, not only password, any credit card information, whatever that is happening, transferring over this HTTP, HTTP protocol, which is insecure uh, trans, transit, guys. It is an insecure layer of transit where whatever the data that is being sent, as it is, it is being sent to the server. There is without any encryption or decryption. Hence, the hacker can eavesdrop and get this data, sensitive data, and uh, take the advantage of that, okay? But coming to the HTTPS, if you talk about, instead of HTTP, if the request is happening over HTTPS, the protocol is, what is the port number? The protocol is HTTPS, but what is the port number of this protocol? Protocol runs on 443, guys, okay? 443, as mentioned here, it is 443. HTTP, HTTP runs on 80. Whereas HTTPS runs on 443 protocol and here it is a secured manner. Why it's a secured manner, I'll tell you, okay? So HTTP, HTTPS means here S stands for secured, guys, okay? Here S stands for secured, okay? I'll explain, uh, S is not really stands for secured, guys. That's, how, that's not how this HTTPS got the name, but S at a high level stands for secured, but... Uh, if we dig deep, uh, it all it is all about certificates, guys. Okay, it's all about certificates. S is a SSL, okay, secured socket layer, okay. And this uh, protocol runs on 443 port number, and uh, the transit will happen in a secured manner where this one two three four five will not be sent as it is. It will be encrypted here, okay. Before it is being sent to the server, at the client side it will be encrypted. Client side, it will be encrypted. Encrypted means instead of sending one, two, three, four, five, it will be converted something like this. AX, uh, like this, okay? AX. No one can understand what is this, okay? So now the hacker tries to <coughs> eavesdrop and get this AX331 uh, LX or whatever it is, okay? And try to use that as a password. The hacker will not be successful because this is not the actual password. It is an encrypted one, okay? This original password, it got encrypted like this. Now, when this uh, data, uh, that is transited here over HTTPS protocol that is uh, 443 port number and all in a secured manner, right? It reaches the server. The server will decrypt it, okay? It will be decrypted at the, encrypted at the client side, decrypted at the server side back to the original data. That is 12345 will be, this uh, AX33LX will be converted back to the 12345 again and server will be able to process. And hacker will get a wrong uh, misinformation here, wrong password here, okay? So, a hacker will try to decrypt, okay? A hacker will still try to decrypt. And uh, you see, a lot of, uh, it's not a simple thing to decrypt, guys. It may take years of time, okay? So we are making the life of the hacker a bit hard. 
so that we are making the hacker life bit hard by not allowing uh, the hacker to decrypt so easily okay or not to not eavesdrop and uh, just find the information as it is and utilize it okay we are making the life of the hacker a bit difficult okay so what number 443 secure communication between client and server because security certificate is there okay security certificate is installed guys okay for example if i take you to this application guys tutorials uh, uh, tutorials ninja application here there is no certificate okay it, it is http protocol guys uh, which runs on the port number 80 okay this is http protocol guys this is http protocol this application is using http protocol means there uh, it is not secure you see the website itself the browser itself saying that this application is not secure don't provide any sensitive information like password or uh, uh, your personal information or any sensitive data like credit card details and all you don't provide on this website okay like that uh, the browser is saying okay and when you click on that you see click on that uh, it, uh, here learn more option is coming and if you will be taken to this page it's clearly saying at the end that uh, there is no security certificate installed okay for this pro uh, website and hence the encryption and decryption will not happen without security certificate the encryption and decryption will not happen but if i take you to this uh, website like amazon.com if i take you to this website like amazon.com here and click on this icon this uh, pad pad symbol here which stands for secured you see connection is secured click on that certificate is valid it is saying okay this website is using some certificate okay click on the certificate all the certificate details are coming so this company is uh, issuing this certificate and uh, because of this certificate here over the transit uh, while the client and server are communicating the communication will happen over a secure layer where encryption and decryption will happen client side encryption will happen and uh, server side decryption will happen using the private and public keys and so on okay if you keep on digging deep right into the security a lot of uh, terms will come up okay so that's what is the case guys here security certificate is installed as i showed you and the port number for https protocol is 443 okay encryption or decryption will happen encryption will happen at the client side decryption will happen at the server side okay so hope guys you understood what uh, like uh, on which port number this https uh, protocol runs on in this session that is 443 so that's all for this session in the next session i'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you till then see you bye bye